Hello everyone, welcome to Home Cooking with me Hema Subramanian. I'm going to show you a Madurai special side dish today. It's called Potlam Potato Masala and Potlam literally means parcel. For this recipe, we're going to make the parcel of potato masala in dried sal leaves which you usually find outside in stores. Sounds interesting, right? So let's get started and check it out. For this recipe, I have taken 3 4 kilo of potatoes here. I've boiled them nicely and peeled off their skins. Now put the boiled potatoes in a bowl and mash them gently. There should be pieces roughly visible and the potatoes need not be mashed too much. Once done, keep the bowl aside. Take a wide pan and add about 2 tablespoons of oil. I'm using sesame oil here but you can also use any other cooking oil if you want. Once the oil is hot, add 1 teaspoon of mustard seeds, 1 teaspoon cumin seeds, 1.5 teaspoons of fennel seeds and saute. After the mustard seed starts splattering, add 1 tablespoon of finely chopped garlic cloves, 1 tablespoon of finely chopped ginger, 2 finely chopped green chilies and 2 finely chopped medium sized onions and mix well. Keep the flame on medium low and saute for 5 minutes. Once the onions are browned, add 1 teaspoon of salt, half teaspoon of turmeric powder, half teaspoon of hing, 2 teaspoons of red chilli powder and mix well. Maintain the flame on a medium low, otherwise the spice powders can get burnt. Now add the fresh curry leaves and mix again. Now add 2 tablespoons of gram flour. You should adjust this quantity according to the potatoes you are using. Mix this all well and this flour adds a nice taste to the curry. At this point, you can add the mashed potatoes to the pan. Mix the potatoes with the masala gently and check for seasoning. You can add salt or chilli powder if required. After the potato masala is ready, add finely chopped coriander leaves and mix well. You can turn off the heat at this stage. Now cut the dried sal leaves into small pieces and fold each one this way to make a cone. Fill this cone with the prepared potato masala. Seal off the open part and wrap the cone with some cotton string to make a parcel like this. That's it. Prepare all the parcels similarly. I am serving this potato masala with some curd rice. This is a famous Madurai variety. You can also use a banana leaf and do the same process if you don't find the dried sal leaves. You can enjoy this with rasam rice or sambar rice too. This is a great recipe to try especially when you're traveling because the potato masala stays good in the leaf for a while. To try this recipe, enjoy and share it with your family and friends. So for more exciting and wonderful recipes, subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell icon to get your notifications. You can now buy the second edition of our home cooking book at shop.homecookingshow.in.